In today's video, I will show you a new chart type in Google Data Studio, Gauge Chart. Gauge Charts give you a way to quickly see how well a given metric is performing against the target goal. You can use Gauge Charts to monitor various performance KPIs. So let's get started. To add this chart type, I need to click on a add a chart and then scroll down and you can see the gauge chart options. We can choose between a simple gauge chart and a gauge chart in these ranges. I will use the second option. Let's configure the chart. I want to change metric and it will be revenue from GA. Then I want to set up a target, so I go to style and then activate a checkbox show target. And uh, target value I want to set uh, 300k. Besides, I can configure range limits. Range limits specify the threshold values for the chart. Ranges often indicate poor, average and good thresholds and uh, are turned off by default in uh, gauge charts. You can add up uh, top 5 ranges to a gauge chart. Let's do it. The first range will be up to 50k. The second one will be 100k. The third uh, 200k and then uh, 300k and 400k. Of course, we can configure the chart appearance, but uh, it is uh, quite straightforward. That's why I want to do it in this video. But I want to show you one more gauge chart type. You can find it under uh, the community visualization drop down. Uh, the difference between this chart and the previous one is that uh, you can configure a more advanced color scheme. For instance, you can uh, make it uh, light blue. Uh, the second one can be red. And then uh, the third one will be green. Although you cannot set a target for this chart, unfortunately. I hope that this video was useful. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel not to miss new videos about Google Data Studio. If you need help with Data Studio, check uh, the links in the description below.